Hello, today we are going to make a futuristic pickup truck. Create a sketch on the XZ plane. Now I'm going to insert a side view picture of the truck using the insert canvas tool. The download will be provided in the description. I'm going to scale my picture by a factor of 10. I'm going to now trace the picture and create a sketch of the side view of the truck. Here is a picture of what your sketch should look like once you're finished. Find the midpoint of the wheel arch and draw a 16 millimeter line below the X axis for the wheel center. Repeat the process for the other wheel arch. Draw two circles with diameters of 21 millimeters. These will be the wheels. Offset the circle for the wheel by negative 2 millimeters or 2 millimeters inward. The outer circle is the tire and the inner circle is the rim. Use the trim tool to get rid of the excess lines shown in the video.
You can use the eye tool to hide the canvas to make the sketch easier to see. Click Finish Sketch. Now we are going to make our truck three-dimensional by extruding the sketch that we just drew. Extrude the lower body of the truck by 23 millimeters. Use the eye tool to make the sketch of the side view of the truck visible. We are going to use the sketch to extrude more parts of the truck. Extrude the triangular top of the truck by 23 millimeters as a new body. When you extrude different parts of a sketch as different bodies, you are able to manipulate them individually as I will demonstrate when I rotate the top triangular section of the truck. Now we are going to rotate the triangular top of the truck by 25 degrees using the move tool. Place the cursor on the bottom side of the triangular top with the triangular face highlighted. Rotate the top triangular section by 25 degrees. Extrude the front side face of the truck by 23 millimeters also as a new body as we are going to be rotating it by 55 degrees. Use the move tool to rotate the front face by 55 degrees. Make sure the cursor is on the line sh as shown in the video and the front face is highlighted. Now we are going to make the rear bumper. Extrude the sketch of the rear bumper by 23 millimeters. Then extrude it outward by one millimeter. Now we are going to make the wheels three-dimensional. We are first going to extrude the inner wheel arch by 23 millimeters. Inset the wheel arch by 5 millimeters by using the extrusion tool and selecting cut. Repeat the process for the rear inner wheel arch. Extrude it by 23 millimeters and insert it by 5 millimeters using the cut tool in the extrusion menu. Extrude the tire by seven millimeters as a new body. Extrude the wheel by 7 millimeters also as a new body. Now extrude the tire outward by 1 millimeter and extrude the wheel by 0.5 millimeters.
Repeat the process for the rear wheel. Now we are going to use the fillet tool to make a smooth curve on the tires. The fillet tool makes the edges of an object smooth. Create a one millimeter fillet on each tire. Thank you for watching and make sure to come back for part two where we will be making the windows and the wheel arch.